I want to ask you about um, the bill that you are sponsoring or co-sponsoring regarding yeah. um, first responders and PTSD. Can you explain what it is and why you think it's so important? It's uh, PTSI is uh, post-traumatic stress injuries. And the way that we're taking this uh, approach is that we have firefighters, first responders, dispatchers, and police, members of our first responders who see things that the three of us would only see in our nightmares, but they see it on a regular basis. And the challenge with that is that um, compounds over time. And so in that particular field, you have the highest divorce rates in the country, the highest substance abuse rates in the country, you have very high levels of suicide and suicide ideation. And right now, PTSI is not covered in their workman's compensation insurance. So, so they end up having to take personal leave, PTO, in order to deal with some of the challenges that come from having PTSI. So Unless perhaps it's actually coupled with a physical injury, right? Yeah, if it's coupled with a physical injury. So if I twist my ankle and I have some uh, PTSI associated with it, I can get coverage. But if it's just strictly a uh, emotional or mental disorder caused by the stresses of mm -hmm. the job, I have no coverage for it. Are so you finding support on the other side of the aisle for Absolutely. This? There's a lot of support. Senator Winder, who I know you'll have on later, mm -hmm. is uh, going to be one of the co-sponsors. And we feel that the, this is the right time to do it, given how much information we know and how much information is out there about PTSI. It's better for us to treat our first responders and help them get back to work than to lose them and all of that institutional knowledge and have to bring on new people. So this is a, this is a way to take care of the people that take care of us. Well, I